Ah, here we come. The warlord of weird. The king of the carnival of carnage. This is the owner and founder of Freak Show Wrestling. A truly unique being. The Freak Show. Sin Bodhi. The bizarrest man I ever met in my life and Sin Bodhi wearing that weird pig mask. Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 666, Big Roy Donuts. The warlord of weird, Sin Bodhi. And he's wearing a weird pig mask and look at his shoes. Teddy bears. This, this is a, this is such a egg, 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 an enigmatic being, Sin Bodhi, you know. He gets into the head of any opponent he's against. You can't read him. You can't tell what's coming from Sin Bodhi. I have to agree with you on that one, Joey. I mean, he is. Oh, we want to get weird. He brings a level of weirdness that nobody else in this whole entire universe can bring. And his opponent, please. Here he comes, uh, former WAW Undisputed World Heavyweight Champion. Two times, credit where credit's due. Brad Slayer. And you got to think, you know, Brad Slayer has never really been in a matchup against someone as bizarre, as odd, it's Sin Bodhi before, but he will bring the fight, Joey. I'll tell you, he's got a heart, passion for WAW like no one else has. I gotta agree with you. Fire. No. He has held quite a few titles in WAW and this is one championship that no one has won. So yep. for him to get the win against someone like Bodhi, see, there's, that you, you can say the new, but there will only be one, the first TWW champion. And, you know, as much as i got to give the, the odds in the favour of the Art of Pro Wrestling and having two members in this tournament, you know, Brad Slayer is a technical master. Sin Bodhi is so unpredictable. You don't know what's coming from him. You know, any one of the eight people in this tournament could win it. I mean, my money's on, you know, either AY or one of our upcoming matches. Oh wait, the card was announced, right? There's yes. Tony Knight. You want to get weird? I mean, to be honest, if you weigh 666 deep fried donuts, you're going to be pretty weird. Yeah, I mean, maybe add a sugar glaze onto it as well. I don't think he needs the sugar, Martin. Getting those flies around. Already Brad Slayers. He doesn't know what to expect. The thing is with Bodhi, even he doesn't know what he's doing half no, the time. No, exactly. He's trying to sucker Brad into but Brad has got his whereabouts so you said you wouldn't want to get on the wrong side of Mick Foley you know in a barbed wire fight I just wouldn't want to get on the wrong side of Symboli at all I'd want him on my side I'll admit he's the most unpredictable wrestler ever Slayer He's got mountains to climb with this one. Of course, he challenged uh, Brody Steele for the WAW International Champion. He came up short, yep. but he did bring the fight to him at fight there. He brought the fight, and he didn't win it. That was just where Brody Steele's pure power was just far too much for Simbodi to overcome. 
Slayer and Brody, they're almost the same height, would you say, from this angle. But, uh, I don't know what, who would be stronger in this kind of matchup. Slayer can't bring the arms up. Brody can't bring him up with the snap mail, though. One way those invisible uh, takes names looking for ankle lock over the doors. Could this be it? This is this is Brad Slayer's go-to manoeuvre, the ankle lock, but Bodie's at the ropes instantaneously, just wriggling around, almost like a contortionist to get to the ropes there. The power of Christ compels you. The power of Donna compels you. <laughs> Brad's number one fan. I think he needs it against someone like Sin Bodhi. Go for the tie up again and Bodhi trying to out muscle Slayer here, Joey. I mean, I don't know if it's the wisest idea. Drop toe hold again face. and hit. Try and go for that. Sin, Sin Bodhi straight on the ropes. Once again, that ring awareness, that is. He may be Smart. bizarre, but he's not stupid. No. Well, they say, you know, genius is one step away from insanity. And it's, I think it's pretty clear Simbody's just gone that one step beyond. Hundred billion step beyond. No, 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 no. <laughs> just, just one, just one. I mean, I'd wear face paint like that any day of the week, man. Oh, breaks the chest of Brad, then kicks him to the match straight for a cover. Sorry, I really should have done that bit, sorry. Yeah. Looking for Tallulah Bell here, but Slayer fighting out of it. Full head of steam for Brad. Oh, kick to the jaw. Just got that knee up, it's just a second nature. Oh, did you see that hammerlock? And he threw him down to the ground. Stomping on his hand. Maybe this is an opening that Bodhi needs. I mean, Slayer has been on a bit of a strength test but without those arms well you know any any professional picks on a part of the body <laughs> that sickening laugh from Bodhi sends a shiver down my spine Slayer going all guns are blazing but it cost him that time he's a boot I've almost got to say, you know, that was a bit of a lackluster camp for the ref for me. Almost. Trying to freak out Marky Whitler. I don't think he needs to try, Martin. He does not need to try to freak anybody out. He's just savaging Brad Slayer's left arm. And right arm now. Gonna look like a corn dog after this one. <laughs> Well, you just got to hope there's no chlorophobes in the audience, you know, because Sin Bodhi, he's founded his own wrestling show, you know, Freak Show Wrestling. He is, he is the clown prince of, of, you know, this bizarre world, combining carnival attractions and professional wrestling over in the United States. And it's a fantastic spectacle to behold. Slayer is in a bad, bad way in his arm. Kind of dangling there, I mean. Slayer, probably on a bit of a adrenaline pump, able to fight back. Look at him, he's like on a... He's knocking his... Simbo, he's been seesawed on the ropes at the minute. But every blow, he's straight back up for another. Slayer, go for that knee, but... Oh! Thunderous chop to the jaw and he's all tangled up! He's going to the outside! Lands hard on the barricade. And that chest is compressed onto that barrier. Those barriers are made out of steel, Joey. And look at the, the weird warlord. What is he doing? That's just, that's, that's frightening. Oh, he's kissing him! I don't know if he's kissing him, Martin. Or biting him? I... Yes. And Brad Slayer spilled hard on the outside. Sin Bodhi's off. Saying hi, Mum. He's seeing blood right now. 
Bodhi might deep fry that blood. Turn it into black pudding. Oh, he went for a suplex. Brad ties his legs up on the rope. But I... Bodhi's now tying him up. Tangling them up in a web here. Shh, we need to be quiet here. Okay. Sin Bodhi busted out the tickle knives. We thought we were going to get the almightiest of chops. But Brad Slayer counters, sends Sin Bodhi into the, t in the, into the corner post. Oh. Got him in the eye. Ow. He can gouge it out near enough. I think that's what Bodhi's looking for here. He means fun right in there, Joey. Oh, did you see that? Oh, I don't think Brad can see anything now. He has been quite literally blindsided. What is Sin doing? Oh! Ties him up in knots like a pretzel and then just drops to the floor. That could pop his shoulders, anything like that. Gain us the arms from Bodie, I mean. Still not enough to put Brad Slayer away. Menacing presence as he is. This is the arms that have just been absolutely molested here. I mean, he's biting on them. I was looking for Tallulah Bell. I mean, you've alluded to that move before, you know. Is, is that a go-to manoeuvre of Simbodis? Yes. That's hard on his back. Variation of a double arm DDT. When he nails it, that's game over for Brad. But Brad... Wise to the world, fighting out of it. Ten count starts up again. Of course, you know, if they hit that ten, they're both, they're out. both out. Yeah, that gives whoever would have faced the winner of this match a free pass to the final. Back to their feet. Ooh. Caught him. Brad's rocking Sinbodi right now. Ducks the line. Fighting it. Variation of kicks from Slayer then. Bodhi looks more dizzy than before. Just a reverse elbow right into the jaw. Sim Bodhi has been rocked right now. Not sure what, if he knew what universe he was before, he definitely doesn't know now. Can he be looking for that Slayer way? Nails it! Absolutely huge drop there. I mean, just... Davin Sinbody kicks out. Brad didn't have enough in him to hook up. As I was trying to allude to beforehand, though, Sinbody bounced a solid six to eight inches off of the canvas after Brad dropped him there. Brad's going for that ankle lock, but he can't get it in. Trying to pick it. Brody did everything in his power to get out of here. Can we sit here, Joey? Once again, he's trying. Oh, Brad picks him up, drives him out. Oh, Thunderbomb! Absolutely beautiful veteran maneuver from Brad Slayer. The wind's gone to Brad Slayer here, Martin. I mean, great display for both men. Yes, yeah, Sin Bodhi put up a hell of a fight and he brought something that Brad Slayer's never fought before. No. He got past the Warlord of Weird. In my book, that, you know, that's a hell of a thing. Now he's in the 
Semi. He's in the semi finals. He will be facing Anton the Young. Ben is um, doesn't want to get in the ring right now. I mean, would you? Tell him the teddy bear. Oh, that's his mask, man. To go lay down. He's calling the pig a dog, and he's going to go put it in his kennel. Yeah. I mean, what's wrong with that? Okay. I mean, when you've taken that much of whatever it's taken to get him in that state, you 